Ladies and gentlemen, the last live demonstration of our Maya Autonomous Inspection Assistant will start in 20 seconds. And there's, there's still four seats free, so hurry up if you would like to join us. We start in 10 seconds, meine Damen und Herren, with the last live demo here in our Maya, our Autonomous Inspection Roboter Assistant. And I darf Sie herzlich einladen, Platz zu nehmen. So now we are ready to start and I would like to welcome you ladies and gentlemen and of course Maya. Maya, how are you? Are you able to talk? Not yet, but maybe in the future, so stay tuned. And Maya decided to record a video for introducing herself. And I think it's the KI in Maya who decided it. So please have a look onto the screen again. Hello, I'm Maya. We are intelligent inspection system. I measure vehicles autonomously and precisely. My strength, analysis, radar, and light measurements. I calibrate ADAS systems, camera and radar. Detecting damage, I can do that in no time at all. Moving and navigating autonomously, that's my thing. Flexible and customizable for every inspection task. Seamless integration into your systems for maximum efficiency. Future proof and always up to date. I improve safety on the roads. Smart, sustainable, and ready for the future. Future of inspection. I'm working on it. Visit me at the stand. See you soon. You're Maya. So first of all, I would like to explain how Maya is designed talking about her components. We have a Maha drive unit with only wheel drive, which makes it possible for Maya to drive in all directions. Then we got a six arm robot arm that guarantees the flexibility for Maya and which is especially important for positioning the camera in different angles to the object. Then we got a projector for measuring and for displaying as well. So Maya has the opportunity to monitor the project, some data or pictures onto the floor at the wall or, for example, at the car as so, well. Then we got high resolution TV cameras at a micrometer range. And we got four body TV cameras in location and, of course, for object recognition. And last but not least, it is very important that you understand Maya as a system because you can decide what kind of management instrument you will mount at the arm of Maya. So that is the future of vehicle inspection. Let's have a look how Maya is working and please have a look at the screen again. Watch as I navigate around a vehicle. I move autonomously and scan at tire level to ensure precise measurements. As I navigate, I detect and measure everything within my range. Thanks to my Omni wheels, I can effortlessly move in any direction. 
My four body-mounted 3D cameras allow me to see everything in my surroundings. Measurements are taken using the camera on my robotic arm, which has six degrees of freedom. This flexibility is a significant advantage, especially in challenging lighting conditions. I can capture images from different angles, ensuring no detail is missed. So Maya's job is to create a digital twin and many uses can be realized with this digital twin, such as a complete measurement, for example, 360 degrees images, damages can be figured out and the positions of the different components can be seen. Also, the measurement of radiation, radar, light, and litter, and we're going to start with the light measurement. So thanks to its precise position, Maya can also detect light radiation and radar radiation with a special sender head. And this makes it possible, of course, to check the correct setting of these components. Secondly, the surface scan and a surface measurement. Thanks to the 3D cameras, Maya can also scan the complete vehicle, but can also focus on specific damages, like scratches, for example. And then Maya can also guarantee the radar scan and the radar simulation as we can see right now on the LED wall. So she has the opportunity to detect the radar wave with a special sensor head. Due to the exact position, she can reach thanks to the six arm robot arm. And this makes it possible that Maya can also position a radar target simulator. And when she can offer this target simulator, we came to the last point ADIS calibration. So Maya is not only your assistant for the vehicle inspection, she's also your um, assistant for the ADIS calibration as we showed today several times with the ADIS test bench here on the stage with the ID4. And of course, tomorrow you have the next opportunity to see this live demonstration. So all in all, I like Maya and ladies and gentlemen, if you like Maya too, please spend one applause for my colleague and assistant, Maya. <laughs>